Hi, and welcome back to Cindy's Creole Kitchen, where we have another episode of Healthy Deliciousness. Tonight, we will be preparing turnip greens. I hope you all enjoy this recipe. Let's get started. Rinse and clean your turnip greens and remove it of all dirt and debris. Then destem them. This is the way I destem mine. I actually grab the stem and I tear down. Really easy, guys. This is a healthy, delicious turnip green recipe. No, it's not your mama's. It's Cindy's. <laughs> but I hope you enjoy, guys. Today we are taking and we're destemming the turnip greens. You will need um, a half onion, one fourth cut of a green bell pepper, yellow bell pepper, and red pepper. You would also need a tablespoon of parsley. You can use dry, I'm actually using fresh. And you're gonna need some olive oil and some honey, which is optional. If you want to help take and get rid of some of the bitterness, you can use the honey. After I destem them, I actually take and I cut mine what I call the square cut, the box cut. I just take some, see if you guys can see it, and I cut like this. Nothing to it, really easy. This is gonna be a healthy, delicious turnip green recipe. I love greens. They're high in fiber. They're actually healthy for you. This is gonna be a delicious one. I hope you guys enjoy it. Give me some feedback if you tried this recipe or not. I actually use a yellow, sweet yellow onion to help cut some of the bitterness I also use the sweet bell peppers because the yellow and orange bell peppers actually has a sweet flavor and that'll help cut some of the bitterness as well. I also use honey, a tablespoon of honey in mine and my turnip greens. Makes for some really deliciousness. So we cut it, which I call the box cut because they turn out to be like little squares. Then you take and I put them on the side and now I'm gonna cut up my sweet yellow onions. Nothing fancy. I just like stuff cut a little small. If I don't cut it really small, I'll just do a standard cut because it's all about the flavor and not the cut. Always remember that. And you can always add more or less of the seasoning. It's to your taste. stumbled upon this recipe while I was in college, believe it or not. A good friend of mine, parents used to make it, and I didn't never understand, I couldn't for the life of me understand why her turn was, was never bitter. But I was young and I didn't ask the questions. I just enjoyed the deliciousness of them. So I'm gonna continue to cut up the onion and the bell pepper and the parsley for this, what I call, healthy, delicious recipe of turnip greens. Yes, guys, the full recipe will be on my Facebook page and my Instagram page. Please feel free to visit there for the full recipe and directions of how to follow. And it's not that hard, it's not, it's really easy. It's really simple recipe. Now I'm gonna cut up my bell peppers. So after I cut up my onions and I place them on the side, I can cut up my bell peppers for my healthy deliciousness that's about to be going on in here. If you are a green lover like I am, I love greens, check out some of my other videos. I have a, a kale and collard greens soup that is really delicious. You can find them on my Facebook page, Cindy's Creole Kitchen, or on my Instagram page, at Cindy's Creole Kit. Yes, guys, healthy deliciousness is going on in Cindy's Creole Kitchen all month long. 
So please come back and visit us. Because I do have a healthy cookbook that's coming out that's called Living Longer by Making Healthy Choices. Feel free to pick it up. You can shop all of my cookbooks at cindysgiftstore.com. You can also receive catering at cindyscreolkitchen.com. This is going to be a healthy, delicious recipe, guys. And also, I add jalapeno to mine. I, I love heat, so I always add a half of jalapeno pepper into mine. So we have the red and yellow and the green bell pepper and the onion. And we have some parsley and we have honey and we have the recipe calls for olive oil and ton of greens. It's that simple. It's delicious, guys. It's really, really delicious. So I just cut up a little free cloves of the, the fresh parsley. But you can use dry parsley. And I also sprinkle a tablespoon or two, and you can add it to your taste of Creole seasoning. I make my own Creole seasoning. You can use whatever you choose. I just combine the garlic powder, the cayenne pepper, the paprika, the onion powder together myself, and I shake it all up in a, in a, in a, in a sprinkler, and I add it to my food. You're going to love this recipe, guys. And this is the ingredients. Really simple, really easy. I've taken the liberty and I've prepared some already. Let's taste it. Let's see if you can see this healthy deliciousness. This is my ton of green, healthy delicious ton of greens. Mm. You guys should taste it. Just the amount, the right amount of heat. Mmm. Healthy deliciousness. I wish you guys could taste it. I'm going to invent smell of vision I promise you. Thanks for joining me. Until next time when we will be preparing a buffalo wings recipe from scratch. Bye.